Yo, hey, what it do, y'all? Welcome to the Phantom Frequency Network. If you're joining us for the first time, you're looking around for some Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse Part 1. Trailer reactions, this is a great place to come check them out, man. We're doing trailer reactions all the time over here on the channel. We got all different types of content, movie reviews, recaps, anime, all different stuff in pop culture. We just launched a music audio-focused podcast titled Phantom FM. Make sure you go over to our podcast feed and check it out. All the information is in the description right there, link in the bio type shit. Y'all know the deal. But we are here to talk about Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse. We're getting the first official full-length trailer, if you will, but trailer 2, technically. And just giving you all some background for those that don't know, I'm a huge Spider-Man fan, literally one of my favorite fictional characters of all time. Him and Batman are my top two superhero slash comic book characters of all time. So I love Spider-Man, love Peter Parker, Miles Morales. Miguel O'Hara, all the versions, huge Spider-Man fan. The Spider-Man PS4 game is one of my favorite PlayStation games of all time. I absolutely love me some Spider-Man. Saw the first Spider-Verse film in theaters, man, with my boy Drew, who y'all might have seen on the channel before. For those of you that are returning, and if you haven't, click that subscribe button. You're gonna miss or you're gonna miss out, y'all. But yeah, my boy Drew and uh, my boy C Dub. Um, you guys have seen him on the channel as well. Did one of the very first uh, pieces of content we ever did for Breaking Bad and El Camino double feature review, man. Make sure you go check that out on the channel. Um, and don't miss out on any of that stuff. But we went and saw Spider-Verse um, four years ago now. And this time, four years ago. That's fucking crazy, man. Time flies. And uh, it was a great film, man. I saw it. That was the second time I had seen it. And I saw it one other time as well, I think. I think I might have went and saw it with Miguel the first time. And then I saw it with... Corey and Drew the second time, I think. So, hey, Miguel, if you see this, correct me if I'm wrong. About the first time, I think we saw it together. Let me know. Um, Yeah. But, uh, yeah, man. And uh, saw the first uh, Spider-Verse film. Loved it. Absolutely fantastic movie. It is possibly my favorite Spider-Man film of all time. Go check out the ranking we did and you can find out. But, with no further ado, let's get into this trailer reaction, y'all, and see what... Lord Miller, Sony, and, and and the directors, which I'm forgetting their name, but they deserve to be name dropped. I'm gonna look it up in a second when this trailer reaction, or when the trailer's done, because I want to shout them out. Those guys absolutely killed it on this movie. Lord Miller producing and shit. I'm a little scouter brain, guys. My bad. When I'm, you know, when you get get through those long days, you know, you just start babbling. But here we go. <laughs> here we go. Spider Verse. <laughs> I can hear you being quiet, Mom. I, um, <laughs> hope I didn't ice your game, man. No one my age says those words in that order. <laughs> it's just hard to see my little man not being my little boy all the time. Yeah. For years, I've been taking care of this little boy. <laughs> Stan the man. Making sure he is loved. That he feels like he belongs wherever he wants to be. Love that shot. He wants shot. to go out into the world and do great big things. Not bad, kid. And what I worry about most... I love you, Miles. ...is they won't look out for you like us. Miles! Wanna get out of here? Wherever you go from here, you have to promise to take care of that little boy for me. Make sure he never forgets. Yo, where he came whoa! From. Yo! Spot that whoa! And hey, Peter he B. never doubts that he is loved. Whoa, who and is that? He never lets anyone tell him that he hey, doesn't belong. Hey, Miguel O'Hara, bruh. You gotta promise, Miles. I promise. Dude, this trailer is fucking incredible. Dude, holy shit. Who do you think you are? Spool Spider-Verse stuff. Whoa, man. We are so supposed many. to be the good guys. We I are. I can't even like, fathom how many like, different references there were. Whoa, man. Miguel O'Hara ain't playing, dude. 
Oscar Isaac, yo. Oh, man. Hey. That was a fucking phenomenal trailer. And it had much more of a somber, more uh, emotional um, vibe that I wasn't really expecting from this trailer, man. You know, the, the last like kind of 20, 30 seconds of it was what I was expecting. I love the way they open that up with Miles' mom, giving him a whole speech, talking about, you know, make sure you take care of that little boy that I, that, that I know and love, you know what I'm saying? And I'm always worried that people aren't going to look out for you the way that we do. That's just that classic parent stuff, man. But the one thing that I uh, had, a, uh, one of the few criticisms I had of the original Spider-Verse was that they didn't really give Miles' mom any screen time or development or anything like that. But since his uncle got killed and everything like that, and I think we're going to get more focus with the mom this time around. And that's going to be awesome to see. And I really hope they double down on that because I wanted to get her perspective and her influence on Miles and get the Latino side of him being half black, half Latino. I wanted to get a good, healthy mix there of both of those cultures coming together to make him the person that he is. Because that's one of the beautiful things about interracial people. In our, I mean, you know, biracial people, whatever you want to say, people that are very mixed or whatever. You know what I mean? It's, it's pretty cool to see that. Um, out there in the world, and it's cool to see that in the in, in, with Miles Morales because that was always very much well defined in the comics. So it's awesome to see them doubling down on that in the sequel, and that's one of the beauty of sequels. I don't think people give enough credit to sometimes when there is a great story to tell and plenty of lore and world building to still do, and there's a way to like bring the characters' journeys forward and make it more meaningful and emotional and give it an arc that really will uh, live with people and really sit in the hearts of the fans. I think that's awesome stuff, and it looks like they're doubling down on. All of that here. I love the whole vibe of that. And then just the crazy amount of references in that scene where it's just full on comic book Spider Verse, hella Spider Man, Spider Man, whatever you want to say, Spider Women, and all that shit. You got a black, uh, you got a black woman Spider Man now. You got Miguel O'Hara up in here. So you got two Latino Spider Man up in there. You had Baghead Spider Man that I saw in there. I, I think I saw the sixth or eight legged uh, Spider Beast Man thing. You know what I'm saying? Y'all 90s kids know about that. That whole arc from the 90s cartoon, if you know about it, let a brother know, drop it. Yeah, excuse me, drop it in the comments. But yeah, man, so many dope references in there. And I'm going to go back and look through that footage, man. Might even do a breakdown for that, maybe. Who knows? But goddamn, dude, there was so many dope like references in just that last 30, 45 seconds of this trailer. Absolutely amazing. This movie is definitely one of my top three most anticipated movies next year, if not my most. It's like fighting Scream 6 for that top spot right now. And I am going to do a whole... Um, ranking kind of video on the channel for that at some point my personal uh, top 10 most anticipated movies of 2023 this is definitely going to be on the list spoiler alert right there cannot wait for this movie man been waiting on it's going to be four and a half years by the time that film drops next june man i can not fucking wait this looks great they've talked about having tons of different animation styles it's going to be something special for sure i really have that feeling deep down inside man i really feel like it's going to be incredible but what do you guys think out there what do you ladies think out there what does everyone in the in the spectrum out there think about this trailer i want to know what y'all think make sure you drop those thoughts down below in the comments we love getting into fun discussions with y'all getting into all the fandom goodness baby but make sure you don't stop there man click the like button the share button if you dug the video and if you like this spread the name around man phantom frequency we're trying to grow our community with all you positive geeks out there man we're just trying to grow this community and have fun talk about the content we all know and love and yeah that's what we're all about here on the channel man so thank you for watching this video and until next time make sure you guys stay safe out there happy holidays merry christmas happy hanukkah all of that and make sure you uh look out for your loved ones as well and until next time y'all peace